Nerium oleander, which is commonly called as nerium, is a shrub or a small tree that belongs to Upper Cynaceae family. It has toxicity spread all over the plant. It is the most poisonous grown garden plant. It is predominantly used for the holy purpose and for the decoration of the deities commonly practiced in India. It is a plant that grows with tall erect stems and branch outwards when matured. The leaves are in pairs or whorls of three, thick and leathery. They are dark green in color with reticulate venation of web type. The leaves are light green in color and very glossy when young and they grow dark when mature. The flowers are in clusters at the end of the branch. They are sweet scented often. Talking about the origin of Nerium oleander, the native of oleander is believed to be the Mediterranean because there is no proper information about the origin of oleander. It is widely believed that it is the native of Mediterranean. Nerium oleander is a Mediterranean evergreen shrub representing the only species in Nerium. Oleander is widespread across the entire Mediterranean basin both as spontaneous native plant and as ornamental cultivated plant. The origin of oleander population is not clearly known particularly in case of ecosystem restoration when the introduction of alien species or population should be avoided. It is found through the research that the origin of oleander population is on the island of Monte Cristo which is located in central Italy. And Nerium is also found to be naturalized to a broad area from Mauritiana, Morocco and Portugal. It also extends eastwards through the Mediterranean region and the Sahara to the Arabian Peninsula. It is also found in southern Asia and other southern parts of China. And it is a plant that widely grows as an ornamental plant in the warmer regions of the world. It thrives in dry soil, although its native is stream banks and other moist habitat. It is widely accepted that the first oleander plant was planted by Gal Winston in 1841 in USA. The oleander was known to the Greeks under three names, Rhododendron, Nerion and Rhododaphne and it is well described by Pliny the Elder who mentioned its rose-like flowers and poisonous qualities. The word oleander appears as far back as 1st century AD when the Greek physician Padanius Discoridus cited it as one of the terms used by the Romans for the plant. Speaking about the diversity of oleander, oleander flowers are showy, profuse in nature. They are often fragrant which makes them very attractive. Over 400 cultivars have been identified and named with several additional colors. Most of these plant is seen with the colors of pink to red and white. Some colors are likely to occur in the wild areas and such colors are yellow, peach and salmon color. Some of the cultivars like Hawaii and Turner's Carnival are multicolored with brilliant striped corollas. There are double flat cultivars like Mrs. Isado Dyer which is deep pink in color, Mathilde Ferreria which is yellow in color, Mott Black which is white in color. And all these varieties are large rose-like blossoms with strong fragments. The sweet oleander which is called as Nerium indicum is a smaller plant with vanilla scented flowers. There are some variegated varieties like variegata which features leaf striped in yellow and white. There are also dwarf cultivars which have been developed offering a more compact form and size for small spaces. While oleanders in the Mediterranean homelands bears flower with funnel shaped corollas. These dwarf varieties include little red, petite white, petite pink, 
petite salmon which grows to about 8 feet at maturity. In Mediterranean climate, oleanders can be expected to bloom from April to October with heaviest bloom usually occurring between May and June. Free flowering varieties like petite salmon and mont blanc require no period of rest and can flower continuously throughout the year if the weather remains warm. Despite the danger in the oleander plant, oleander seeds and leaves are used to make medicines. It is used to treat heart ailments, asthma, epilepsy, cancer, menstrual cramps, leprosy, malaria, indigestion and several other venereal diseases. And extracts of oleander plant have been used to kill bugs and rodents for centuries. A great interesting fact is that Napoleon lost 100 soldiers when they dined on a meat roasted on the wood of oleander plant.